Hey YouTube, it's Alicia here and I am at my hotel room and I'm going I'm doing this video real right quick because I just wanted to give y'all my reaction of some of who was drafted from Raw. So let's get started. The first I wanna start with the women. Oh my god. Let's start with Bailey and Amber Moon being drafted from from Raw to SmackDown. So now my my situation is where is Sasha gonna be? Is the next thing. Yeah. All right, that's that. So that that break up the hug, boss hug connection. Then you have Amber Moon that's gonna is over there. Wow. And then the call up was Kiri Sa Kiri Oh Shy. Kiri Shy. I don't wanna blotch it, but Kiri Shy, I hope I pronounced her name. And Oscar end up coming together as a tag team. Oh my god. I was shocked. And here comes Mandy, and like they like act like it's them, and y'all know it's not because Paige don't want to have nothing to do with them. To get me to say this, who they think they are? Paige said a new tag team. I would have never thought it was Carrie. Oh, Shirai. Yeah, here we go. Carrie Shirai and Oscar is as the new tag team, but it seems like they might make a dominant tag team in the, in the tag team division. I'm going to see, we're going to have to see what they're going to do with Bailey and Amber Moon, but I won't, I won't, I won't get to get my, um, my dream match, and I'm going to talk about that in a minute. Um, then you get Elias being drafted over there. You get Cazaro drafted over there. You get Kevin Owens also drafted to SmackDown. Oh, my God. And the biggest one of all, Roman Reigns got a new yard, and it's SmackDown, baby. Don't forget, The Rock stayed on Raw, um, started on started his career on SmackDown and Roman Reigns is coming from Raw is coming from it's coming from Raw to SmackDown. So we're gonna have to wait and see where this is gonna go. But I hope um Sasha is drafted to Raw excuse me, drafted to SmackDown because I wanna see what she can do. Excuse me, y'all got a little bump here and thing but it is going to be very interesting to see who the rest of them will be but we're going to have to wait until next to this saturday to see who are the full people that's going to be drafted if i could say one more person from raw to be drafted to smack down i would say nia Jax. come on nia Jax. nia Jax drafted to smack down that's great and then, it started off as the girls, you know, confronting Becky Lynch. And I'm just going to say, excuse me, Iconics. Like I was saying, the Iconics, they're more of a comedian type like thing. I need to talk about one more other than um, Lars. I don't know if I pronounce his name right. Lars debuted on SmackDown as well. And he interrupted our truth and Carmella. Carmella was in a match with Charlotte Flair and um I think Carmella ended up losing doing to Charlotte Flair. Like I keep saying saying I'm gonna get more on that at a later date of why I'm so disgusted with Charlotte Flair. But Sasha, or not Sasha, Carmella ended up losing. And so, as Carmella, Carmella is scooting. Our truth is like, is aiding her. And then all of a sudden, Lars comes out. And our truth is like, oh no, I'm not going to let this guy 
hurt her. So he's like trying to stand up for Carmela. And then I get that like as an older guy, he's trying to do that because he's not going to let some any old somebody come in and hurt her. So I want to see what y'all think about it. And let me hear from y'all. And the question of the night is, was it honorable for our truth to stand up for Carmela? against Lars. Okay, until then, I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.